I greet you all, beloved, in the wonderful name of our Lord Savior Jesus Christ. You welcome to this channel. I am Sakila. God is saying you do not know yet. Hallelujah. God is saying, yes, I know. You do not know yet. Hallelujah. Sometimes in the presence of God, you also be confused of what is happening. You don't know sometimes what will be the outcome. If you ask me, did I know that I will end up here? Did I know that this will happen? I will tell you some of the things I've never pictured them. Some of the things that were not even sent to me in a vision. Yes, the Lord might have spoken to me to say, you're going to be a woman uh, 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 of nations. You're going to be great. You're going to influence nations. You're going to have impact in so many nations. But God didn't know, he didn't tell me how. Hallelujah. God is saying the things that you do not know, I didn't know. So God is saying you do not know yet. It will soon be revealed unto you though. Let us then quickly look at the book of God in the the book uh, of um first John chapter one first John three uh verse one to three. Behold what manner of the love the Father has bestowed upon us, that we should be called the Son of God. Therefore we knoweth us not, because he knew him not. Beloved, now are we the sons of God, and we do not yet appear, it has not yet appeared, what shall, what shall we be? But we know that when he appears, we shall be like him, for we shall see him, as he is and every man that has this hope in him purified themselves even as he is pure hallelujah god today is saying we know that when jesus christ comes we'll be like him we know that we shall not lack anything we show when we are sure we know that there is no there is no weapon that is formed against us that shall prosper we know that god has good plans for us which is plans to to prosper us we know that there is no sicknesses that shall be in our body and live in the name of jesus christ but we don't know what god is going to do that the word of god today is saying you might be asking yourself you must you might be concerned as how would god change i remember the the the, the, the bible explains that this man asked god how can a man be taken back into their mother's womb and be born again god is saying whenever he comes we will be like him so god is encouraging each and everybody that it is understandable that yet you don't have an answer it is understandable that you don't have the knowledge yet but what you know that god is going to come and change the situation in your life god is going to come and do something great upon your life stay blessed and continue to watch the channel in jesus mighty name amen